Hello, 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 everyone. So they had an update to The Sims um, before the Life and Death expansion pack is out. It's coming out around Halloween. I can't remember what day. I did pre-order it, so I'm excited for that. You can now pick which occult you want to be, whether you want to be an alien, a vampire, a merfolk, a spellcaster, a werewolf, in cast now. Um, I don't want to be any of those. Can I, like, be, like, be a ghost? I don't see that in, like, my list of options, so, like, um, I guess maybe if I pick, like, a cause of death? That's interesting that you can pick that. I mean, okay. Um, I want her to die for laughter. Ooh. Now he's a ghost. Okay, sweet, sweet. Now can I just, like, exit that so I can actually create the sim first? Um, I want a little, a little lady ghost. Um, I like... What hairstyle do I want? I don't know, like, what mods or CC I have that is... Like, I don't have any mods, but, like, I don't know what CC I have that, like, is still working, um, in-game. So this should be very interesting. I love these eyebrows. I don't know if they... I actually kind of like them on her. I was gonna say, I don't know if they work on her face. But oddly enough, I think they do. I just think if like she had like not so much. Let's see. Kind of like a more. Oh, is that like? Our ears back a little. I kind of like that. I I kind of like that look. Maybe different eyes. Maybe yeah. I think different eyes would would help. Yeah, I don't, I don't mind that. And maybe, like, closer together. I don't mind that at all. <laughs> um, I, I, not how I, like, typically would make a sim, but I kind of like it. I really want to do this green outfit, but I don't, I don't think it works on this sim. This doesn't look green at all. Like, none of the colors actually match. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> I kind of want her to look... I don't know. I don't want her to look like she's from this era. Like, I, I feel like... Because I feel like I could have any sim that's kind of from this era. So maybe something... Oh, I like that brown shirt. Um, I like that a lot. It's not really what I was, like, thinking of. I want to give her, like, a peasant look. Like, I don't know. Like, like a medieval peasant... I don't know how I want to dress her. This is strange for me. Because, like, usually I at least have an idea of what I want to put on the sim. Ooh, I like that. I don't know if that's, like, culturally appropriate for her, though. But I really like it on her. Um, I mean, if I want her to have died from laughter, I kind of think she's, like, a very outgoing sim. Maybe she's not, like... Maybe she is a sim from, like, this century trying to think. I'm really thinking really hard. I think I'm thinking too hard about this, but I want, I, I kind of like that. That's like not too modern, but like not too like old school. It's kind of like a nice balance of maybe some blue shoes, maybe some, some black socks. Maybe not those socks because you can't see them. You can't see those ones either. Can you see any of her socks? Maybe, maybe these. Ooh, maybe some green socks. Oh, I think it's the pants I chose. Oh my goodness. I was having a moment there. Um, yeah, maybe not those green socks on second thought. Um, none of these socks are, well, I guess we could do the black socks because we chose a black skirt. Um, I don't know, I, I feel like the shirt matches the blue in her outfits and it's like, in my experience, I, like say, I, I was at a college campus, which I'm not, I haven't been to college. Um, I would want to wear shoes that are comfortable to like get me through the day and they, they match her shirt. Even in like high school, I wasn't one for wearing skirts, but if I did, I would have like shoes on. Um, I don't know, that's just me though. I like to do the makeup last now that you can put it for like every outfit. Um, I kind of like this. I mean, she's not really looking like an like a old school, older vampire. I don't know if that's formal wear either. I kind of like this as well. Although I don't, oh, the skirt's not working because of the pants. Well, we can fix that. That, okay. This one's gonna be tricky. Um, does this work with any of the- no. Okay, well I need to get that piece of CC out of my game then. I need to like, go through my CC because some of it's older. 
Um, but I think I found the skirt I want to work with. Because I think I want her to be, like, maybe a college kid. I know I've gone through a lot of talking. I'm, I'm thinking out loud. But I feel like, like, a college kid would be, like, realistic for, like, the sim I want to create. I think, I think she would be in college. I think she would be having, like, the, the time of her life in college. Oh, I love that. That, that browser. Oh, I didn't even notice the hair in the back. It has, like, a accessory. Oh, well. <laughs> like, I don't mind it. Um, I'm trying to think. Like, what would I wear in college this time of year? I don't know what anyone wears in college. Oh my goodness. I fixed a sim to create that, like, is really outside my comfort zone. Because, as I said, I have not gone to college. I don't know what I would wear to college. I have a very, like, kid-friendly aesthetic. <laughs> like, I wear, like, I like my Disney clothes and things like that. I don't know. I might wear something like that in college. I like the yellow. I don't know if it really goes with her first look. I mean, it sort of does. It's like a sweater and a jacket and a skirt. Uh, whereas this one's more like everyday. I guess for like a formal occasion, that would work. I don't know what for formal occasion she's going to in that. I'm not asking questions. I'm moving on to the next outfit now. Um, I, 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 I love this CC, but I haven't found a sim that I feel like it works on yet. Because like the patterns are very loud. For me, anyways, this is lonely but fabulous. Why do I relate so much to that? Um, American Apparel, hold me. Just hold me. <laughs> that is, okay, that's a little forward, ma'am. I kind of want to do, like, maybe a cheerleading kind of look, like, for cheerleading practice. Maybe something like this without, like, the skirt. I feel like she'd be a cheerleader. She gives me cheerleader vibes. I don't know what cheerleader vibes are, but if anyone has them, she does, you know. Or maybe like track, maybe she does track, track, or gymnastics, I don't know. She does a sport, I don't know what sport. Tell me what sport in the comments you think she does, because I, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just going with what's in my head for now. Um, thank you very much. I love like the, the Yoda. Oh no, is that a cactus? I thought that was going to be Yoda, because I'm pretty sure I downloaded these, because they were, like had a Yoda picture. Hmm, well... There's a strawberry one, but I don't really think... I kind of like the the idea of, like, like one of these shirts that, like, maybe she wears to college, but she just kind of goes to sleep in them at night. Or even, oh, the PJs. These, I don't know where I, I got these fun PJs, but I love them, and I would wear them. I want them in my size. Um, I'm just saying whoever made them made, like, the perfect PJs, um, in my opinion. <laughs> I don't I don't remember the creator so like don't ask me for the creator in the comments because I don't I just genuinely don't know but they match these boots so good this would be me going to sleep and I'm gonna give it to her because like she's still young if like we're thinking she's in college right she's still young she can she can rock that I kind of want to give her like this but in like a fun color I guess, I guess that's a fun color. I, I'm like, I want to give it to her in a fun color, but let's go with black and beige with a little bit of teal because it's not too outside my comfort zone. Maybe some black pants just to add to the, the fun. It's a very fun outfit. Um, I'm, I'm sure I have, I, there's somebody that dresses like that that's getting offended in the comments. If so, I apologize. It's just, I wear bright colors, so, like, when I think of fun, I think of bright colors. Um, but I just, I just dress the sim very, like, I don't know. She's got green, she's got yellow, and then I was like, let's do fun colors, and I went for black and beige. I don't know what party she's attending. Um, maybe it's, like, a study session. I don't think she parties much, to be fair. Um, she doesn't look like a sim that parties a lot. I feel like she came from, like, a very privileged family, you know, um, and, and it is enjoying, you know, that kind of lifestyle that comes with that. Um, I don't know what lifestyle would come with that either, but I wish I did. <laughs> I would love to be, you know, up there with the monies. I don't think money buys happiness, but I, I could use some money, you know. This holiday season's been rough on me. Uh, it's been it's been real rough. Uh, um, I like to spoil my family, and it's been rough. And, and then you know, Halloween is for kids, but like I like to like put 
put a lot of effort into Halloween and like I like to get like some Hershey's bars to hand out to the kids in the complex and whatnot, you know, in case anyone so I don't know who would stop by my door, but I want to be prepared, if that makes sense. Um, I feel like this is a more fun outfit than her party outfit. She goes to a lot of pool parties, okay? She just didn't go to a lot of, like, college parties. It's not her scene. Uh, I feel like she would be on the swim team. Um, I made a whole backstory for this sim as I'm dressing her. Uh, that's, I, I don't usually, usually the sim tells me the backstory. I don't, I don't just come up with a backstory. Um, just so you know, now you've learned something about me. Um, I don't know how this reads hot weather. Um, I don't really want to ask either. Like, do I want to know what makes this hot weather? I'm really not sure I do. I kind of like the white skirt with it though, but like it's not very high waisted. I kind of wanted something high waisted. This is very high waisted. I kind of actually like that a lot. Can we get a black skirt? It were, oh my goodness, that, that I actually like that a lot. Oh my goodness, can we get these shoes? Oh, no, not those shoes. That, no, maybe these. I'm not sure I like those either. Maybe a boot. Maybe not a boot. Maybe something, like, really simple. Maybe these. <laughs> I'm like, maybe. Just find me a shoe that matches, because none of these... None of these, to me, match, but they all look so good. I like those. For like a hot summer day, you get your little maxi skirts up a little slit, but not too far up because you still want to look classy with the little, you know, little throw and little short sleeve shirt. Oh my goodness. I, I love that outfit. Okay. And then we have, um, I actually like the sweater. I feel like this sim would be very festive when the holidays come. Um, I do, I do see, I do see that being her personality. So like, I'm not mad at it. Um, I just kind of wish... Well, I kind of like these pants. Okay, and then can we find her just, like, a nice shoe? Why do I feel like she would wear, like, the blue shoes? Oh, it's Halloween. It matches, though. She could do some white shoes. Maybe just some black shoes. I kind of like the black shoes. Oh my goodness, that's a fun outfit. I want to know what other colors. Maybe it's the Santa one. Um, you know... I don't know. Maybe it's too fun. Can we just like see what like a plain cardigan looks like? I don't. I don't like that either. Um. Okay. Uh. Um. Maybe something like this that like tucks over. It shows a little bit of skin, but not too much skin because we stay classy, ladies. Stay. Stay classy. Not that like not showing skin makes you classy, but I'm just saying. I'm an old school person. I like being covered. I make my Sims. Uh, very, very color covered as far as outfits go. Usually, usually, it depends. Really, it <laughs> it really depends on the day for me. Um, and then I'm gonna just give her like a lot of makeup, kind of like she doesn't know what she's doing with her makeup. I kind of like that. Um, no, I'm not gonna give her a lot of makeup because that maybe just something like really simple. Maybe just like some simple eyeliner. I don't like the lip gloss now. I feel like the lip gloss makes everything I add to this too much. Maybe just like a simple matte and then we can go with some like eyes, eyelashes. Then we can do like just a little cheek blush. We don't really need, that is not a little cheek blush. That is better. Maybe that. I think that's like a good amount of cheek blush. Uh, and I'm just thinking like, can I get like a really simple black eyeshadow? Cause that's like the only makeup look I feel like I'm super good at, at like knowing and putting it together. Even like this, maybe like with the black, fine, you know. Well, that's a very different vibe. I kind of like this one better. Um, okay, I feel like she is ambitious. Uh, she's a bookworm and she is an overachiever. Loves to study this one. Um, I do feel like she's active though, but I can't give her that trait in bookworm. I guess I could take off Ambitious and do like just the Overachiever. Where's the Where's the Overachiever one again? Yeah, I could just do Overachiever and Active and like then the Bookworm. Um, okay. Uh, I want to, I want to, her to like want to go to university. Um, and I'm sorry, my dear, you are, well, you're about to become a ghost. Let me just give you some likes real quick. Um. I feel like she she does enjoy research and debate. She likes writing, 
She loves a good yoga day. You, I mean, you saw the 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 active wear. She enjoys a bit of fitness. You know. Um, I feel like um, maybe she enjoys some photography, just because like I would want to capture college memories. I don't really know what else she enjoys. Maybe knitting. I could see her liking knitting. Um, okay, and maybe she likes a bit of violin. Why not? Just because I can. Uh, I feel like she really likes the color green. Uh, black, gray, and, like, blue and yellow. Um, oh, and, and white. Yeah, she can like white. Um, there, she likes all, pretty, almost all the colors. I feel like she's not really into ambitious sims. Um, but she does like hardworking sims, idealist sims, homebody sims. She's not, I, I don't think she cares whether you're optimistic or pessimistic. Um, but I feel like she's, like, not into people who are emotional thinkers. I feel like her romance style is very much gift-giving and affection. Um, I feel like her fashion is, I don't know what, how I describe her fashion. Her, the hair color she's drawn to, uh, tall, dark, and handsome. Just very, very g generic. Um, she does like a bit of orange hair, you know, now and then. Maybe a little, little auburn hair. Maybe blonde hair. Um, and then, um, uh, she likes red hair. You got a little red hair dye. Mm -mm -mm. She gonna be after you. I'm gonna call her Bethany Sanders, just cause it's the it's the first last name that came into my mind. And now we are gonna pick her cause of death. Um, oh my goodness, she could have died from a broken heart. Why do I feel like that would be so accurate in college life and so dramatic? Yes, you're not gonna die from laughing. You have not now died from a broken heart. Um, meet our ghost. Uh, she's very lovely. Um, I, <laughs> I love it, I love it. <laughs> oh my goodness, I don't know where I'm putting her, but I, this, this new update where you can, like, like, design your ghost sim and, like, see the outfits you're putting on them makes my day. Because, like, you could give them a really cool backstory. Um, I'm trying to figure out where I'm gonna put her now that I've made her. Um, because I don't really have the, the space for her. Uh, maybe in Brightchester. Is there anyone in Brightchester who just looks like they could use a haunted ghost? I mean, they could use a babysitter. Um, <laughs> they have one, two, three, four, five kids at least, plus the two parents. She would make the eighth sim. I don't think they need more kids. Um, I don't really want to put her in the Foxberry household. I feel like, yeah, I feel like this, she would just fit right in with them, you know? Um, she could even, like, bring in some cash. Uh, that might be nice. We could bring her to this family. Uh, that's not as well off. Uh, maybe I should be putting her, like, Vlad the Vampire. Is he still alive in my game? Mm. Like, where do I put her? Because, like, I, I, I want her to have a place that is comfortable. Uh, I, uh, I don't know if I want to put her with Vlad. I thought about the Vitor family. Oh, there's an empty house right here. Perfect. Now it's a haunted house. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm so excited. There was an empty house. It was just meant to be, y'all. I'm going to get a little picture of her in the empty house. Um, <laughs> I had so much fun making her because you can actually like see her clothing before you killed her in Cass. Because um, we did kill her in Cass. And I've never seen a Sim die with the new romance pack. So, oh, this is, oh, this is a nice little house. Unfurnished, just awaiting. I kind of feel like I should furnish some of this. Like, maybe the bathrooms, at least. Um, okay, let's, uh, let, let's do plumbing. I, I don't really know what th these bathrooms would have had. Maybe, like... These are very small bathrooms, first off. Um, maybe, like, we could do, like, a little... Like, a little, little shower head kind of deal with, like, a sink. Maybe not that shower head. Maybe I want a cheap shower head. Maybe I want this shower head. And we could do, like, a little toilet action, you know? A little... Why is that not... I fixed it! <laughs> I fixed it, y'all! Um, no, actually, I, I kind of want... I want this over here, but that's 
that's not happening until I fix the door. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to fix the door situation. And then we can just like put this on the wall. Um, so it's functional at the very least. We have a functional bathroom. I just want like, I don't want to like fully furnish this house. Cause like, I didn't make the house. I really don't care about the house. That sounds bad when I put it that way. But like, I genuinely, like, I just want at least some of the basics. So that if I move a sim in with the ghost, some of the basics are covered. You know, like, it would be, it just would be nice, you know, um, to have, like, some stuff in here. Um, maybe I'll do, like, the toilet straight when you walk in, you know, so that way if you walk in on somebody, um, you don't walk into them washing their hands. Uh, you, maybe that's a bad plan for the bathroom now that I think of it. So, I think what we need is, we need that, and then I think, I think for a shower, and we need... Uh, this shower again. I, I don't know if that'll work. That, will that even work? I feel like maybe if like this. Maybe if we just. Maybe it'll look like it's awful. It looks awful. Um, okay. Uh, you know. Um, this game really just sometimes. Who builds? I hate diagonal walls. I really. I'm not a fan of them. As you can tell because like look at this there how do i make this look good i don't think there's a way to make this look good um unless i make the hallway look weird which like i would do that but like i think this might be the best i'm gonna get actually you know what i think the best i could do is actually just leaving that taking out the shower because who needs a shower right you don't need a shower in every bathroom, right? You can just have a sink. That's all right. Not every bathroom. It's, it's a half bath, you know? You never have a half bath. I'm like, no, nah, I, I changed the plan because I don't like the, the, the shower. So now we're doing it differently. Um, because I, I, once again, I just don't like, I don't like the way it was done. So here we go. Um, okay, I feel like that's the bathrooms. And I feel like I could do like a little kitchen area. I don't know where in this house the kitchen would go. I think along those back walls is what the game is telling me. Um, I don't, I'm trying to think of like some cabinets that a ghost might use, but I'm out of ideas. So we'll just leave it for like whoever buys the house. Um, it'll really be like a rags to riches house. <laughs> I'm probably gonna move in one of the fox areas and it'd be like, what, there's no furniture. Where is my sim even gonna sleep? I'm gonna be so mad about it later on. You know I am too. I'm gonna be like, I did not have this planned. This was not, it was not in my plans to furnish a house on this move-in day, but uh, here we are. And here we are doing things we never thought we'd be doing. Okay, and I think that is it for y'all today. Thank you for watching. And I hope you will join me for another gaming video. Maybe a doll unboxing, maybe a different toy review, maybe a shop with me. Uh, who knows what we'll be doing next. Um, I'm currently waiting on a package, a surprise package for a little surprise unboxing. It hasn't come yet, but hopefully it'll come soon. Bye.